Hi there guys, uh, Chris Ellis here. just want to make a quick uh, tutorial here to um, let you guys know about a PDF um, tool. Uh, a, lot, a lot of you use uh, Adobe Reader to view uh, PDFs and uh, I know a lot of you download free versions just to view PDFs and uh, a lot of you do not want to pay for um, the upgrade to actually create PDFs but there are a lot of uh, free um, programs you can use to create PDFs. I just wanted to show you one that's uh, pretty pretty simple, quick and easy. Um, if you would go to www.primo excuse me primo.pdf.com and it will bring you here and um, it says it's the world's number one free PDF creator uh, you will go here and um, click to download uh, once it downloads uh, you go install this program once the program is installed you will get uh, an icon on your desktop now to show you how easy this is um, I'll set up uh, some articles here in a folder um, these articles, uh, as they come up, you'll see uh, coin collecting as a hobby, uh, coin collecting for kids. Move this over uh, to the side here, and you see Primo PDF. Now, how easy this is, as you watch, you can just take, drag that file, and just drop it there, and um, the software goes to work. As you see coin collecting as a hobby comes up as a PDF it's automatically as a PDF you can also still set this up to come up um, in your Adobe Reader as I have here Adobe Reader is still set as my default uh, PDF Reader and uh, I get that out of the way you'll see that coin collecting as a hobby has been put in the same folder that the notepad uh, article was in but now it's a PDF and that's uh, pretty much how simple and easy this is it's just a simple drag and drop now uh, to go into some of the options you can just open that up go here on the options and you can go to creation PDF settings um, open with and you can use uh, default PDF view is if Adobe is set as your default PDF reader then that will automatically open all your PDFs in Adobe so I uh, just wanted to give you that quick tutorial of uh, primo PDF dot com uh, download it installs very simple and you just drag and drop and you have a PDF and it also works uh, this here is notepad but it also works with uh, Microsoft Word so if you were to write an article or ebook or something and uh, you save it in Microsoft Word just pull up drag and drop and there you have it you have a PDF